All right, guys, welcome to Kathmandu. In this video, I'm going to try to show you some street dogs. And we're right here on the Dobikola River. I see one laying over there. And some of these dogs, I noticed they have like skin conditions. So obviously there's probably a problem with fleas. But from what I read online, the most problem is actually rabies, obviously. So here's two guys over here. A lot of these dogs, you know, they they look pretty good condition. So they fur is good and everything like that. And they look like they're eating good and they're super friendly. You see, they come right up to you. So obviously these guys could have some type of care. Here's the other guy. And you can see that they hang out in these certain areas, like over here where this new building's coming up. So I'm sure they have people to actually take care of them and feed them and check them out. They're pretty friendly guys. At nighttime, you'll hear them barking a lot. But there's one guy over here that I always see and I wanted to show you. So let's see if he's here. He's the one that looks most beat up. And from what I read, some of them are doing good, but then there's always gonna be one that's beat up. And this guy that I usually see over here, he has like a lot of hair that's lost, but this guy is just laying down. Here's the butcher. So a lot of these guys will just lay down and they sleep in the daytime, guys. So they wake up at night and that's when you hear them mostly barking. The butcher's here, so they're always gonna hang out and get meat because the butchers always give them, hi, how you doing? You speak English? No, no. no English. No, I just wanted to ask because I know you don't speak English, so it doesn't make sense, but this uh, like egg cooker, egg cooker, cooker, no, no. dog. And he had like a little problem, like, little sick right like i see him over here i was trying to show him because my youtube they like to see the dogs so but usually mm. okay next time thank you namaste donivad donivad dairy donivad so he's always over here the other guy but he's not here right now so that that's the butcher and you know they always hang out over there i don't know maybe he's gone right now but he has like a skin problem Let's see, maybe he's down here somewhere. You know, these dogs are very smart and they hang out in the same areas all the time. Yeah, so, yeah all the time, man. Yeah, man. <laughs> What's up, guys? What's up? What's up? Yeah, Thanks, man. <laughs> all right, guys, we'll see if we find some more along the walk today. All right, guys, so here's another dog you can see, but he's not a street dog. If you see they have the collar, that means they're usually being taken care of by somebody. So, but they do hang out in the street. All right, guys, here's another street dog, but see, they, they hang out. So a lot of the locals just take care of them and they'll kind of like keep them, you know, close to the store. So I consider them like a hybrid street dog, you know, just because they stay out all night. They Technically, they don't have a house, but they're going to hang out in the same areas. And the older they get, they don't travel as far. You know, this guy looks pretty old, so he might just stay here all day in one spot. And the younger ones, they could go blocks and blocks. There's one that we know that always comes up to us and he literally came up to us the other night and we were gonna buy him food we went to buy him biscuits and he was all the way off down the block so he traveled like at least five or six city blocks but he always goes back to the same spot to sleep at night all right guys so here's another guy over here he probably probably the locals probably know him i see the lady is looking he's totally passed out he looks pretty good uh, i'm not a veterinarian or anything He's totally sleeping, but he lives over here by, by this shop over here. So I just wanted to show you guys, you know, I'm sure that... Namaste! He's, he's the, your dog. No. He's street dog. I don't know. <laughs> but you see him all the time. He stays here, right? Yes, yes. Yeah, I just was showing my YouTube because they like to see the street dog. So I just wanted to show them and try to explain to them in Nepal that these dogs, they live here. Like they sleep in the street, but they still come to the same place every day. And the locals, they sometimes they give him biscuit. You have any biscuits? You're giving, right? Can I give him some? Can I buy some? Okay. I'm gonna leave some biscuits for him, guys. There's a certain biscuit here in Nepal. It's only 10 rupees and they always like to eat this one. So I'm gonna buy it. This is one of them. And there's another one called Erolu. It's dust? Yes. So 10 rupees, guys. So I'm gonna leave these for him. Thank you. And when he wakes up, maybe he'll eat them. But some of the dogs that live by the butcher, they will actually refuse these crackers. Oh, he's up, guys. He's up. He's up, guys. So I'm gonna give him some of these, and we'll see if he eats it. He looks super cute, guys. 
Let's see if he eats it. I don't know. He's not really in the mood. No, he's sleeping, guys. But when he wakes up, when he wakes up, he'll he'll definitely eat it. But like I said, some of them already have the taste for meat. So, all right, guys, we left it there for him. And uh, yeah, he can probably get checked out. How you doing? Namaste. So we left it here for him, guys, and hopefully he'll eat it when he gets up. Let's go see if we can find any more. Okay, guys, here's two more street dogs that I always see in the same neighborhood. They love to sleep under this thing over here. I guess it keeps them cool when the sun is coming. So it's like, let's see if these guys want some crackers. You want crackers? Here you go, guy. Uh, they don't always eat them. I guess they're not hungry, guys. These guys always hang out here, so there's, an, there's another hybrid type of street dog. He's not gonna eat it. He's probably already getting pretty good food over here. I think this guy might have ate one. Here you go, guy. Okay. guys are definitely looked after because there's a store over here but how you doing namaste i was just giving them some cookies some biscuits these dogs they always hang out here right always i see them here these guys but they don't have a home that's the only problem <laughs> i'm doing a piece on street dogs because uh my youtube they love to see the dogs you know and they always tell me try to help them so i'm like give them some biscuit and I found that in Kathmandu, there's like three or four different shelters. They come, there's one in Bauda, and they'll do treatment. But these guys look good condition. They, oh, you always, you must see these guys every day, right? They're good, they seem pretty healthy. I don't think there's anything. This guy is so friendly, but he doesn't want to be pet, so. All right, thanks a lot, okay? Don't even. So the shop owners know these guys, and you know, here's an, there's two more, but these are definitely house dogs because they're coming out over here. All right, guys, here's another one. He's got the collar, or she's got the collar, so she's probably somebody's dog. And this guy right here, he's got a collar too. Usually when I see they have the collar, so they'll beat up. But you, Namaste! But usually when I see they have the collar, I always think that somebody owns them. But he definitely looked beat up on his back. Let's see if the other guy's up here that I wanted to find. Okay, guys, uh, here's one guy, and he looks like he's waiting to cross the street. And this is something that uh, he looks pretty beat up, he or she. Oh, he got a little scared. So let's see if we can help him cross the street. Because he's pretty smart, he knows when to cross. But he's super beat up. Let's see if we can get him some crackers. His leg looks a little bit messed up too. So a lot of these guys, I guess they get, definitely get beat up. Let's see if we can get him some crackers, guys. Here you go, come on, let's come out of the street. His legs are a little bit, maybe he's just like that. Yeah, let's see. He's licking his lips, guys. So he definitely likes these crackers. There you go. One crackers? Oh, he's going in. Here. So we check him out a little bit. You can see his fur is a little bit messed up. Namaste. Namaste. Do you know him? Gartai. 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 Can you translate, babes? Gartai. The guy is talking to me. He's trying to talk to me in Nepali. You want me to put you on speaker? Oh. He's, 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 you know him? You know him. He said he knows him, I think. Let me put you on speaker, babe, so you can talk to him. You're on speaker, babes. Huh? <laughs> Thank you. Don't evad. Okay, bye bye. <laughs> All 
All right, guys, here's one more. This guy looks pretty good. Not too beat up like the other one. He's friendly, though. Super friendly, man. Big guy. All right, he's out of here. All right, guys, here's two more dogs that I see. I don't know if it was the one guy that I was looking for, but these guys are just hanging out, man. They're just hanging out, chilling by the store, sleeping in the day. This guy's a little beat up. You can see on the fur is a little bit messed up. On the back, over here. Namaste. But I guarantee you all these store owners know them. And they definitely feed them. All right, guys, this is the other type of biscuit, arrowroot. So I'm just going to get a couple more. Thank you, Donibat. That's a Brikuti place over here. Go in here and see. Big open area. Yeah, guys, these dogs are not stupid. See, I see one over here. They hang out in the spot. I think I see one knocked out sleeping over there. So we got one pack, arrowroot. We'll split it and we'll give it to the guy. Let's see. Here. If this is the guy, if this is actually Namaste. I just wanted to see this guy over here. He looks pretty good, healthy. English speaking, English world? No. <laughs> you know him? No. He's a good dog. Oh, I'll give it to him. Oh, he's hungry. He's a little guy. Oh, yeah. This guy is. Definitely hungry. Here you go, guy. See, they don't like these crackers. No, he's not gonna eat it. All right, we'll leave it here just in case. Masu. I think he likes masu only. Masu. Masu is meat, guys. So he needs the masu. Monpayo masu. Thank you. Don't even. So these guys hang out over here, you know? They're not stupid. They're gonna find somebody or a store Let's see this other guy over here. And they're going to stay there and just keep going back to the same place. I'm sure you guys know way more about dogs than me. So comment if you like the video. Let me know where you want me to go. I'll definitely try to go to the shelters over there and see. Let's see. Namaste. Namaste. Is he a street dog or is he your dog? He's a street dog. Yes. Uh, I'm just going to give him a little bit of crackers. My, my viewer, they like to see the street dog. So I try to film a little bit and show them. They keep saying, help the dog, help the dog. I'm like, I can't do not. You know, I could give crackers. That's it. I'm not a veterinary. <laughs> but there's uh, so many different um, places in Kathmandu, like three or four different places that actually, you know, help the dogs, you know. So I just wanted to see. Let's see if he'll take it. Biscuit. Kukur, kukur biscuit, kukur ko biscuit. He wants masu. They don't want biscuit. He wants something from one of these places. A little, a little rice and uh, yogurt. A, a little rice and yogurt. Yes. How much is, did they sell it here? No, I, I already. You already gave it? Yeah. Oh, thank you. I'll thank you for my viewers because they're gonna say thank you. <laughs> you rice and yogurt, really? Yes. And he like it. Man for yo. Okay. Let me give him this one. He's not gonna eat it. He's already full. So you guys take care of him. Yeah. That's why I think a lot of people, they don't understand that, that these dogs are like, they, maybe they could use a little bit of care, but the community really takes care of them. And they hang out in the same area, they come back, you know? I noticed that. So, and they're good, they're so friendly. All right, thank you very much. Have a good day, guys. Thank you. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more videos like this, just comment below and I'll try to make it over to some of the shelters in the next video and see what they have to say about the situation here with the street dogs. All right, guys, we are at the School of Languages and I just forgot there's actually one more guy over here that hangs out. So he's completely passed out sleeping. He's got a nice spot. You can see they choose these kind of nice spots, obviously. Let's see if he's hungry. He's a little bit sleepy, but oh, he got scared. Sorry. Give him some crackers. Maybe give him a little energy for the rest of the day. Go ahead, take it. Eat. Kana. Eat the crackers. Cow. 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 Now these guys want meat. 
All right, we'll leave it here for him. I try to feed him. Ah. Cow. Cow, cow. Cow. <laughs> He's gonna go for it. There we go, guys. It's a win. It's a W, guys. Alright guys, here's two more dogs over here. These guys are on the move, they're running. They're checking out the goats. These guys like to stick together, man. This is the pack. This is how they do this pack mentality. Let's check them out, see how they look. They look pretty good. They look pretty healthy. Two small guys. They're on their way. They stay in this area probably. And they do their thing. He's a little scratched up on his nose over there, you can see. Other guys are a little scratched up. In the back looks a little bit old guy we had some meat but they're friendly guys they don't attack you know they're just chilling so the other ones i see they're mostly messed up with the fur but these guys look pretty good it's a little pack these guys are out they're gonna go get some food looking for some food probably give these guys some more crackers maybe erorut kukur biskir kukur kur dinus get some crackers for these guys and go feed them but the dogs over there uh uh char don't even see if these guys are gonna eat it where are they there they are they're crossing the street guys these dogs are very smart they can cross without getting hit Let's give it to him. Let's see if he eats it. assessment on him his ears got a bit of, bit of something here behind the ear he's got a little sleep in his eye scratching all right we'll leave it here for him all right he's going for it it's a win guys we got it feeding him good yeah we're we'll giving the rest of the pack the guys that I wanted to see this is the guy this is the guy I was looking at he's a little bit beat up guys here you go here you go here he doesn't want it these guys are all looking he doesn't want it all right I'm out of here so this is the guy guys if anybody knows what's happened to him he's a little bit messed up under his fur maybe he's the one that has gotten all beat up out of everybody the other ones look good how you doing namaste Give a little bit to this guy so he's hungry. I'm good. Here you go, guy. Here. And to this guy. But definitely, guys, out of everyone, this is the guy that I always see that's the most beat up out of everybody. So he's got some damage here. I'm going to try to ask the guys about him. Give him the most. I'm going to try to ask the street dog care guys about him. Maybe we can give him a rescue. All right, guys. So, like I said, he's the, he's the dude, bro. Looks 
so okay under there. Those are all the dogs I saw today in one day walking about a mile back and forth. I'll put the links to the organizations here in Kathmandu and a webpage that lists a bunch of other ones. If anyone has any info on the conditions we saw today on some of these dogs, I'll pass that information along. Please give this video a like and subscribe if you appreciate the content. Thank you for all your well wishes and support for these dogs. I'll try to investigate the situation here more. Thank you for watching.